With Galaxy AI, Samsung is giving you features that can help you keep your job with writing assistance, edit your image with the photo editor, and translate chats so that you can be able to talk to people in different languages. What is all of the fuss about and why should you care? Let's dive into it today. Hi, I'm Captain Awesome. This is Geekception. Make sure you hit that like button, subscribe if you like what I do here, and let's get into what Galaxy AI actually means. Samsung is not using ChatGPT, but they are using AI and they are using it in many ways when it comes to the Galaxy S24 series. Let's start with the first feature. You know Samsung really thought about Galaxy AI because they brought the features right into your photo editor, such as background fill that enables you to fill the background when you straighten an image. So imagine you take an image it's not actually level so you try to you know rotate it and boom it is able to actually fill in the gaps there with generative ai which is really cool next is object recomposition which allows you to move remove or resize people and object then fill in any gaps in the background there's also instant slow-mo which galaxy ai uses to generate additional frames based on movement so that you can get that super slow motion when you tap and hold on the screen now it doesn't change the actual image itself but it's just really cool to just see your images slowed down without any sort of artifacts. Live Translate with Call Assist. And this one is really cool. Basically, it enables two people over a phone call to be able to translate their call in real time. And the best part is you do not need to install any third-party app. It is with the default phone app that comes on the S24 series. Using AI, it is able to translate from one language to the other, which is seriously cool. And when I saw it live in person, I couldn't believe my eyes. The lag was pretty much much almost non-existent and for the languages that are supported I think it's going to really come in handy and this next feature I think is one you're going to like because it enables you to take all of your rage chats and translate them into very very formal chats with writing assistant you get two features under one style and grammar and chat translation just like chat GPT with style and grammar you can be able to change the tone of whatever text you want to send so that you can turn it from maybe very goofy to very formal or even the reverse there are five tones you can choose and it was seriously cool seeing this in person chat translation is even cooler because thanks to the keyboard and ai samsung is able to not only translate each individual each message it is able to translate your entire screen and it supports multiple apps that you already use such as whatsapp or even your messages app it was really mind-blowing seeing conversations in another language translates to another language in real time that was really impressive. Long web page, ain't nobody got time for that. Congratulations or condolences, but I ain't reading all that. Well, you are in luck because with browsing assist, Samsung with AI, well, Galaxy AI, is able to summarize all of the contents of a page into a condensed text, which you can then copy and, you know, paste into your other apps, which I think is really nice for people who like to, you know, just skip to the good parts. For the note takers out there, note assist is one that I think you would find really helpful because it is able to take your handwritten notes and not only use AI to be able to convert them into text, but it can also format them as well. And you can even choose many different styles. When I, I saw it, it was really mind blowing because I have always used handwritten text and that has always been my pain point. Well, no more with the Galaxy AI on the S24 Ultra here. Another AI feature they brought is Circle to Search in collaboration with Google, where you can just directly search for anything by drawing a circle around it and boom, you get the information and unlike let's say google lens for example this enables you to even have additional context as well which is super nice these are some of the standout galaxy ai features that i tested and i think it is really cool most especially because ai here used by samsung is not one where they try to go the chat gpt route where you can chat with something and it will generate something instead i think they took an approach where you or even me a person who does not know anything about technology can use the power of ai without having to know anything about uh, interacting with any interface is just part of your phone it's right there and you can do so much more with it now and i think thanks to the power of the snapdragon 8 gen 3 for galaxy that is in the s24 ultra specifically it enables some of these ai functions on device and for some of them they work in the cloud and for some of them they're sort of hybrid it's on device which means that it uses your phone's power to be able to you know process all of this and for some of those features like in the gallery for example it actually uses the cloud as well so you must be connected to the internet 
internet to be able to use it. And there you have it. That is Galaxy AI and what I'm excited about. Now tell me, best friend, what are you excited about, especially when it comes to AI and the new Samsung Galaxy S24 series release? Um, I would love to know all of your comments down there below. And yes, that has been it for me. I'm already hyped for unpacked event. And uh, you know, you've probably seen all of the devices that have come out by now. So tell me what you feel about all of them. And I definitely look forward to bringing you more videos. So tell me what videos you would like to see about the S24 Ultra and I'll try to do that as well. Until next time, I've been your captain of awesome. Don't forget to subscribe. It really helps me out here. This is Geekception and I will catch you next time. Don't forget to stay awesome. Bye.